people, I'm going to try and capture another side of me. So one year, I remember, the sink had flooded. Flooded onto the floor and everything. And that was when I started catching the extra water. I didn't throw it down the sink. I put it in the bucket and bring it outside. Yeah? It's an OCD person who has to make life easy for me. So this is what I've just done. I've started doing the edging. The grass is there for the lawn. But I'm not going to do too much because I don't want my back to play up. The next thing I've done, as you can see, I've cut the trees, store the branches over there. And this is what I've done. I've made them smaller because I'm going to take them out eventually. And look what I've done. I put the covers in here because in my head, I'm thinking maybe I can use it for something. I don't know. It's just the way my brain works. Yeah. There was a worm here. And I know it was trying to get down back in the soil. And I actually dig and cover it. So I think it's all gone now. And there was another one coming from there. So I think it's all found a home to go rescue. So that's me over and out in my garden. I'm going to find things to do to keep me occupied. So all I need now is my appetite back. So I've finished from morning. What I had from morning is finally finished. Going after six and it's just now. I don't know how I survive, but I'm surviving. So yes, as I said to them, that's residue paint from my husband painting and decorating. And I was looking at my jacket. So this was one of the days I went down to do decorating down by bird in the bush. <laughs> so see, the paint is on there and also on my trolley people. So yes, I'm finished now. I'm going to go inside. So that's therapy in my garden. Therapy in my garden.